All right, guys. Uh, here's these Weimer inner putts. <clears throat> Sorry, I'm gonna do this video here in oh, toenail short. I'm gonna do this video here in the basement. Of course, they're running around like all get out. But come on, come on, come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. There you go. They're going everywhere. Uh, so I hope I get this in the video. But uh, it is nasty outside. It rained. I meant to get a video this weekend. It snowed Sunday. It rained all day Monday. It rained all day Tuesday. So, anyway, I've tracked mud in everywhere in my basement, but I just wanted to get them out here and everybody see a picture of them running around, letting them get used to being in the house, too. I've got the males in one pen. I've got the females in the other pen. And Bo there, he's a Brittany. It was supposed to be picked up three weeks ago, but the guy hadn't came. He's supposed to come tomorrow and get Bo. Uh, so I guess I could get Bo out and let him run around and play, too, since they're all trying to play with him. Uh, come here, Bo. Ah, what are you doing, buddy? There you go. We let Bo run around here too. Uh oh, they found him a piece of a dog feed bag. What y'all doing all back in there, huh? Huh? Well, come on. Oh, they having a ball. They gonna make a mess. Sports over. I can see it coming. Uh, anyway, come on, guys. Come on. Come on. What y'all doing? Oh, they having them a fun time here. There goes one behind the. Here, I'll get them really going. Watch this. I'll get a little bit of, little bit of dog feed in my hand. I may lose a finger here. Hey guys, look here. Look what I got. Woohoo! Huh? Are you hungry this morning? Come here, come here, come here, come here. All right, maybe we can get them all bunched up if I tease them with a little food here instead of them running all over here. Come here, look here. Whoop, whoop, whoop. Uh, but if you can tell them apart, you're doing better than me because they all look the same. I actually have to just pick them up and look at the numbers that I made on them, the marks. Uh, yeah, I see y'all. I see y'all. Where you going? There goes Bo. He's keeping some of them back there playing. So they're just, they're just running everywhere, growing like weeds. Uh, still like about a week and a half before they're ready to go. Uh, but they, uh, gotta trim y'all's toenails though. Woo! Uh, now, just for some, uh, here you go. Just, just here. Go ahead. I'll watch my fingers. Here. Come here. There you go. I, I, watch my fingers. I'll get, go ahead and get that dog food out of my hand. Uh, ow, it's a finger. <laughs> what y'all doing? Yeah, I see y'all. Uh, so I think we got them all except for... I think there's one still back there playing with that piece of pa uh, paper. Uh, ow, 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 ow. Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. I like to do this out in the yard where they can run. Of course, here you got about 10 foot you can run. And there's... So many things to distract them, they run off playing instead of paying attention to me. Uh, but uh, a couple other things I want to mention to y'all. Uh, now I keep them on cedar and pine shavings, as you can see in these little pens I've got set up. This is where I usually keep them until people pick them up. They've always pooped and peed on cedar and pine shavings. So it'll help you a lot when you get them to get you a bag of the flake type shavings, pour you a little circle of shavings out in your backyard, and when you take them out to use the bathroom, take them to the shavings. That way they'll uh, kind of It'll trigger that I got to poop and pee. I'm on shaving, so that works real well. The other thing is, let me tell you, uh, when you go get a crate, get a crate big enough for a 70 pound dog, uh, get the ones that's made out of wire like this. Of course, they have a top and they have a divider, and you can move that divider back and forth as the dog grows. Uh, that way, you only got to buy one crate for the life of the puppy. It makes a lot more sense than buying crates as the dog outgrows them. So, yeah, I see y'all. As you can tell, they've done got used to the house. I let them out down here yesterday and played. I've moved them into the basement now, so they're actually staying down here with us. Uh, and they'll stay down here until they're picked up or shipped. There's actually a couple of pups that need to be shipped. Uh, the two people that are shipping, uh, I'll just say this on a video, that way I don't have to send an email. Please send me your name, address, phone number, and the airport you want the pup shipped to, because I gotta have all that before I can ship them. Of course, that's still a few days away, but go ahead and send it to me whenever you see this video and think about it. Uh, hey, come here, come here. So, let's just see. I see. Uh, you can still see the marks in them. Uh, one, two, three, four, five. That's number five male there. He's still available. Which one are you? Come here. Which one are you? Which one are you? Uh, that's number one female right there. One mark right on her hip. Number one female. What are you doing, girl? Go on. Go on. Which one are you? Come here. I mean, I ain't gonna put you up. Oh, and that's number one male right there. 
like I say, I just grabbing them as I go. That's all I'm trying to do here. Well, here we go. Uh, number two male. One, two. What are you doing, buddy? Well, you are a pretty thing. Uh, but yeah, sorry about the lighting. The lighting's not the best down here in the world. I hope I'm getting this in the video. Hopefully I am. Of course, they're, they're, <laughs> they're everywhere. Uh, which they should be. That's puppies. And that's how I call them. And get them to come to me. Come on. Come on. What are you doing? What are y'all doing? Huh? Come on. Hard thing about having them in this cramped up situation here in the basement is not stepping on nobody's feet. Whoop. Just about stepped on one then. Uh-huh. Come on. Come on. Come on. Come on. Because they want to run. They want to play. And... What are you doing back there, Bo? Come on. Get up behind there, Bo. And they love to get over behind them cages. Especially if they find something like that piece of paper that one right there's got. Here. Here. Bring it out here. Come here. Come on, bring it out here and play with it. Let everybody have a chance. Instead of hiding it. <laughs> there you go. <laughs> yeah, yeah. I think they've overwhelmed Bo. He just went back there and sat down. He said, I'm just going to sit back here. <laughs> Is there too many of them, Bo? You know, Bo ain't used to that many puppies at one time. Where you going? There it goes. Like I say, that's the bad thing about trying to do it down here in the basement. There's so many things to distract them. They're just going everywhere. They're just going everywhere. That's right. You're just going everywhere, ain't you? Uh-huh. Uh-huh. Of course, they'll put another pound on or so before everybody's ready to pick them up. They're going to grow a little more. Uh, but anyway, I just wanted to get y'all a little quick video. I promised one this weekend. The weather just was not holding up for me. So, uh, y'all please excuse my basement. I use this as a... As you can tell, I use it for a mud room. There's my coveralls where I go out and clean every day. and uh, So I use it for a mud room and for puppy pickups at the same time in the wintertime. In the summertime, we do it out in the front yard. But wintertime, it's just too nasty. We do it down here. So kind of makes a mess out of my man cave. But then we'll I'll clean it up when the weather breaks. And then after that, we'll come down here and me and my fat kids and watch movies or play Xbox sometimes. Uh, but... Anyway, just wanted to get everybody a little video of the pups uh, so y'all can see them all running around and see how they're all growing. What was that y'all turned over? Ah, they're into everything. All right, I'm going to get off this video because it gets too long. Uh, it takes forever to upload. All right, we'll see y'all later. Bye.